the hospital, right? And, well, for one, she thought it was going to be a boy, and she had picked up the name Stephen, but then I turned out not to be a boy, and they didn't know what to do. Right? So, they never even had a girl's name picked out. So then, like, mother and father's friend came in, and uh, he opened up baby name book, and he said, you got to give this youngster a name. It's enough, but, right? And just picked the baby name book, closed their eyes, opened the book, and pointed. Teresa. That's a true story. Like, imagine it could have been way, way worse, right? I like names that are, like, easy to pronounce and spell and memorable, right? Like, I like special names if it means something to you or whatever, right? Like, I, I can't tell you her name because, like, you know, I don't want to offend nobody. But, like, you know, I figure her mother made her name up, right? Like, isn't that real? Anyway, but I mean, to each his own, right? Who cares? But like when, but like last names are even funnier. Yeah, like in Newfoundland, Labrador, right? Like we got like, like a smaller gene pool, shall we say? Like I don't mean that in a bad way. It's just that like most of our, most of our settlers come from England or Ireland. So like we got the same like last names, right? You know, it's the names like, Miller, and Roberts, and Stagg, and, you know, and O'Reilly, and stuff like that, like Power. You know, it's all those names, right? And everyone knows somebody by that name, and usually you can tell where a person's from, right? Like if your name's Roberts, you're likely from Triton area, right? Stuff like that. If you're Stagg, you're probably from Bonavista Bay, or something like that. But, like, you know... <laughs> When I was living in Ontario, oh, like, we had all kinds of different names from all over the world. Right? Like, I work with people in Victor and Mitsku and stuff like that. Right? Different. Like, and you don't even know where they're from, right? Like, you, like, I don't know. It's just, it's just different from what we're, we're used to here. Right? But it's fun. It's just, like, sometimes it's hard, you know, actually saying the names because you don't know, like, you're not used to them. Like, I used to work for government, right? And I were working in Ontario, and I used to have people, like, like I used to look at their names, and there was no vowels in it, and even letters I didn't even recognize. And then you had to call them up on phone, and you're like, oh my, how am I supposed to ask for that person? I can't pronounce their name. And then you look for the first name, first name just as bad. Right? One I looked at, I swear to goodness, she had like 85 letters in her first and last name. And like, again, some of the letters weren't even letters. Right? What are we supposed to ask for? Right? And you, you calls up and you says, Can I speak to Revision Jin Chama Chan Ching Chan? And they're like, Do you mean Sue? Right? Like if your name was Sue, just say Sue. Don't say Wing Ching 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 Chan. Right? Like I don't even know. But sometimes, like, people, I met one girl, right? She's from China. Well, she wasn't from China. She was born in Canada, but her family was from China, and her name was Helling, H-E-L-L-I-N-G. And I said, oh, my, that's a different name, right? I said, I heard of Su Ling and Mei Ling before, but I never ever heard of Elling, right? And she said, well, you know, mother and father, they like the name Helen, but they just didn't know how to spell it. Yeah, true story. Right, I find that very funny. And then anyway, so when I was working for the government, right, like I said, they come across all these different names. And this one, Mrs., she goes, boy, she got to come here. Look at this. Look at this name. Can you believe this? Name was Hiscock. I didn't even find that funny. I said, sure, there's ton of Hiscocks down home. We got a restaurant called Hiscocks. Sells best wedgies in town. Yeah, I like to have some of them now. Yeah, they closed down. I loved them. Scrap witch, fries, dressing gravy. Even that hot dogs. Yeah, you know they. Anyway, I hope you have a good day. Bye.